We continue our Twin Tiers football season previews this evening with Tawanda. The Black Knights are looking to continue improving this fall after finishing in the middle of the pack last year. Now last season, Tawanda finished 3-3 three and three in large school division play, 3-4 and four in league play, and 4-7 and seven on the overall season. Head coach Craig Dossie says the team had overcome some adversities last year after losing their offensive coordinator very early on into the regular season. He feels his squad did well last year with the obstacles they had in their way and has high hopes for them going into the season. Ultimately, he's excited with how motivated the team's been so far for this fall and looks forward to seeing the growth from his returning cast. They, they're very motivated. They, they want to take the next step. They understand what happened last year, the leadership that, that, that got them to this spot. And I think they just want to take one more step, whatever that one more step is for them. A lot of people don't realize we lost the coach um, last year in the second game of the season, our offensive coordinator, um, with an amputation, a foot amputation. So um, we always talk. I, I let the kids define their season and what it was. Um, and I think last year, I think they're, they're proud of what they did. I'm really excited about our defensive team. Um, I think we have some kids that can, can really press things and, and make things happen on that. And I think we're working offensively. I think the biggest thing from last year to this year is, is um, scoring points so that we can defend those points. Um, so I've been working really hard on that. Not that we didn't do a, a terrible job last year, but I think a big piece of it is you have got to have points to defend. All those guys, they got big smiles on their faces coming into the field. They laughing it up, talking about, wow, I, I'm ready to play this year. Yeah, I'm ready to go. I'm ready to show something this year. And now taking a quick look ahead, here's a sneak peek at the first five games on Tawanda's schedule. They're on the road a lot in the first couple weeks of play this year, but in their first week of play, they're going to take on North Penn Mansfield. And the following week, the Black Knights are still on the road as they take on Milton. September 8th is going to be their first home game of the season as they're hosting Northwest Area. Then Tawanda is back on the road again for the following two weeks against Canton and